advantages and disadvantages of a ATM or debit card. In these days, getting an ATM card is very easy. Whenever you open a new account, either a saving or a current account, you get a new ATM card. So in this video, we will discuss about the advantages, benefits and disadvantages of ATM card. We will also discuss where to use ATM cards and where not to use ATM cards. Also, we will discuss about the safety and security features of ATM cards as well. Now, first we will discuss about what are the benefits or advantages of ATM card. ATM card is very easy to get first of all because whenever you get a, a new account you also get a new debit card and there is no many more documentation as well you don't need to su submit any other document exclusively for your debit card just you have when you open a new account you get an ATM card uh, also most private banks offer an ATM card as soon as you open a bank account the first advantage and uh, the very important is when you have an ATM card in your pocket, you don't need to carry the cash or the checkbook to make any payments. Because whenever you're going out of your of the city for travel or for any purpose, you just carry your ATM card because you will find ATM machine everywhere in every part of your country or city or state. So it is very handy and light. You need to just put your ATM card in your pocket and just move. Also, with the use of ATM card, the purchase, shopping, dining, or doing anything is very easy. Just purchase something, shop something, or dine anywhere in any restaurant. You, what do you have to do? You have to just swipe your ATM card, and payment will be done. So again, it is very easy uh, to do the activities or to anything related to your uh, shopping or purchasing with the help of ATM card. You can make online payments. This, this is very important feature of your ATM card because you, uh, you can make online payments whenever you book a hotel, you book uh, a flight ticket, railway ticket or bus ticket or anything. You have to just make the payment online by using your debit card, assistant digit number, expiry date and CVV. You can also load some money in your wallets like paytm phone pay google pay etc and from where you can again make payments for online requirements also it is very easy to track your uh, spending purchases and also the balance because every time you use atm card to withdraw cash or you are swapping your debit card to make payment in shop in a, uh, in a restaurant or in a shop or you are making any online payment by using atm you get an sms instant sms describing your available balance so here atm cards make easy to know that how much is my balance how much balance is available in my account so you can have a good idea about your balance available balance and you can then make purchases as per your requirements now we will discuss about the disadvantages of ATM card we have discussed advantages and we have seen that how it is uh, easy to use ATM card and how much convenience ATM card is giving now there are since there are some disadvantages of using ATM card as well. We will discuss it one by one. First is you can spend only amount of level in your account. Suppose uh, your account has 40,000 bucks. The balance in your account is 40,000 rupees or 40,000 dollars. So since ATM card is directly linked with your saving account or or the current account so you can spend or withdraw only money that is available in your account connected saving account or current account second is for is charges and fees most of the debit card have charges either it is 500 rupees per year or 1000 rupees per year depending on the type of the card your bank charges <laughs> your bank charge you yearly there is a fees for yearly <clears throat> yeah of debit card as well if you are uh, going for some platinum debit card, the charges will be higher like 3000, 5000 and even 10,000 10, as well for, for some ATM cards. And there are some charges as well of uh, when you withdraw money from ATM uh, 
you may be charged because in india there is a rule that you cannot use other bank atms more than five times if you are using other atms more than five times you will be charged suppose 20 rupees or 30 but these rules getting changes uh, time by time so this particular rule is not fixed but yes most of the most of the time if you are using any other bank atm more than five times you will be charged a nominal fee safety and security is very important whenever you are using your atm card you have to be very very alert and there are drawbacks are associated with the debit card because you have also heard about the debit card frauds debit card cloning there are many machines uh, that are uh, inserted uh, installed in the, uh, in the atm machines that, uh, that can clone your card as well so in these days as the technology uh, technology is growing up we have seen or uh, we are hearing many more uh, fraud cases of atm cards as well so safety and security is very important when you are using an atm card you have to be extra cautious and you have to be extra alert whenever you are using an atm card so atm card using atm card does not increase your credit score how much spend you are doing you are making one lakh rupees two lakh rupees in purchases these atm card users is not going to increase your credit score credit score is very important when you are applying for a credit card or you are you are applying for a loan whenever you apply for a loan your credit score will be checked so atm card does not help to increase your credit score this is the drawback of atm card as well now here we will discuss some safety tips of using atm card whenever you, it is very easy to get the atm card but you need to be very alert while using an atm card so when you are using an atm card to withdraw machine in uh, to withdraw cash from atm you need to be alert the first thing you have to do is you have to seal the keypad to your hands when entering pin anywhere suppose you are uh, entering your pin in atm or you are entering your pin in swipe machine when swiping your card so you must seal the keypad by your hand so that no other people can see what pin you are entering. Never share your card details. You must never share the, your card number that is a 16 digit card number, expiry date and CVV to anyone because the bank officers never call you for any such information and there are some fraud people for registers call you and ask you for these details like card number, CVV and expiry date never never tell them about these details and also never share or your otp whenever you make an online payment you receive an otp so never share this particular otp to anyone these are the some safety features of the atm card now we'll give some for setting pin of the atm card you must not set the pin like one two three four nine eight seven six double one double two double two double two double three double three double nine double eight like this because these pins are very very easy to guess and you must never write your pin on the atm card most people many of the people make this mistake that whenever they receive a new atm card they just write the pin over the atm card so this is a very big mistake you must not do that Never use your birth year as ATM. Suppose your birth year is, is 1995. So you should not share your ATM pin as 1995. Never share your pin to anyone. Never, never share. And you need to change your pin regularly to stay away with fraudsters. These are the some tips that you can use while setting ATM card. And also I shared and told about some tips for using it, your ATM card safely. So I hope... Uh, you like the video if you have any questions or suggestions you can write in the comments and i will re uh, reply as soon as possible so guys please like comment and share the video as well thank you and have a nice day